Hello everyone, welcome to the Arduino practical series. In this particular series, we'll perform various Arduino practicals. Uh, so, we are using the Tinkercad online resource. So, this particular resource it can be used to perform various electrical practicals, electronics practicals. So, let us create the circuit. So, just create, cre uh, just click on create. Giving me option 3D design circuit or code blocks. So, I need to I need to click on circuits. So when you click on circuit with the, we get this canvas so first of all let us select the components so the very first thing which we need is the arduino so as you can see arduino uno r3 click here we just drag this component here the second thing we need is the breadboard so so this is the breadboard small just click bring this here and then the next thing we need is the light emitting diode and resistor as we can see we get the led here just place this here i just put it here and the resistor i put it here now we need to connect this two components with this arduino therefore we are using this breadboard so first of all let us select this led okay now this led in this case as we can see this is the anode and this is the cathode i'll just uh, flip this just I'll just flip this so this this left becomes anode and this right becomes cathode so I'll just place this on the breadboard so this is how I place this okay so this is placed okay now next we select the resistor now we'll make it vertical okay. sorry horizontal this is already vertical so one more okay so just put this here sorry let's put it here now uh, one more thing this resistor as by default is 1 kilo ohms we want 330 ohms so i'll just put 330 330 and this is ohms now we'll go for the connections okay so what we do is we connect pin number 13 as you can see we have this pin number 13 we connect this to the anode of the led so we just go here click here and uh, can do one thing here so this is the connection i can connect on any of this line in the breadboard we can connect at any of this line now this is connected so this part of cathode is connected with this terminal of the resistor so now i connect this part of the resistor the next part of the resistor any of this line can be connected to the ground so I'll just click here take a wire and we connect this to ground so here we have various ground connection two ground connections are just connected here okay this ground is connected okay so now circuit is completed okay we connect we take this third pin number 13 to this part and this one to ground now we can even change the color of this wire if you want so that ground we can just change the color of this uh, green to black so this becomes it shows that this is the ground wire now before running this simulation we will just click here to check the code okay so here it is blocks when you click here on the code it will show blocks and here we have the various options are there uh, you can just click on text and continue so this is the required code it will come automatically we don't need to do anything okay so this particular line it initializes the pin this pin 13 is connected to the led and then this loop will run infinitely turning the led on and off so this ensures that led is high uh, the, the led is on for the delay time is 1000 millisecond it means one thousand one second so it will turn on mil uh, the led for one millisecond and put it off for one second that is 1000 millisecond so now let us run the simulation you can see it is running so for one second this LED will glow and it will be off for one second so this is how we put we run this particular practical for blinking of LED so that's all for this particular session thanks for watching